work setting. My name is Gretchen Castle. I'm General Secretary of Friends World Committee for Consultation World Office in London. Um, I, I found the soul of leadership to be incredibly nurturing and uh, when I signed up it was a time when I was feeling a bit depleted and wanting very much to have some reflective time as a leader of an organization and needing that kind of space and so and it, it certainly did that for me. It gave me that place to think about why I do what I do and give it meaning and, and base it in my spiritual life. Mm. Yeah. Soul of Leadership has been a great reminder that uh, we are spiritual beings and that in organizational life, the more we can bring to that I think the stronger the organization can be. Certainly for me in a Quaker organization that's that's the case and it's I think it's enriched very much enriched um, my interactions with staff, my ability to manage them and to be uh, collaborative in, in that workspace. Uh, there's so much uh, that I could say. I'll begin with uh, appreciating the balance of sharing, of learning, learning about uh, organizational change models that we could use in the workplace. That was very rich. The sharing of each other, learning from each other, having space to uh, worship and minister to each other and just share our life experience was extremely rich. And the balance of all that was very, was very helpful, very good. Hmm. Well, Woodbrook is just a lovely part of the world. It's lovely to be here, the gardens, you know, walking the, the labyrinth was very grounding, being able to go barefoot in the grass, you know, I don't do that in London very often. So it just, you know, it's just a lovely, lovely place to kind of come for that retreat element. For me, that was really hugely important. I think anyone would benefit from this program, really. I found it particularly useful to be with other people who were just seeking the sense of soulful purpose, a sense of um, how, how do we use in the workplace, how can we be more soulful. So for me, uh, it was great. We had quite a variety in our cohort. So there were, you know, people that came for many different reasons and all of those were valid and wonderful and helpful. So I, I think anybody who comes, really so much of the, the value of the program is the cohort being together and with these facilitators who just created space for us to really explore what we were there for. It, it was remarkable. A lot of, I think, our work as Quakers and our uh, work to help bridge gaps and help people talk about and communicate uh, with people that we don't often talk to or see, it's just a, t a point in time, I think, right now when we need to um, elevate love and um, our human interactions really are important. So thinking about that soulful, uh, bringing soul, bringing spirit into all aspects of our lives, helping to integrate uh, what we believe and what we imagine to be helpful for the world, uh, to have that reinforced, to know that others are doing the same, uh, you know, it really helps us feel that we're not alone in our vision for the world and helps us all work toward uh, bringing peace and justice and God's love into the world. I, I sought out a subsidy and received some, and my workplace paid for some, and I paid for the bulk of it, but it was very, you know, it was a really um, wonderful just affirmation that it was the place for me to be having received some of that, uh, the financial assistance. Oh, there's so much I could say. I think uh, there's so much I could say about uh, the value of soul of leadership for me, both personally and, and in my work. Um, 
I think having it spread out across two years gave time in between to use and uh, and try some of the ideas that we talked about. For instance, we talked one time in one session about being appreciative. You know, and it, I'm I'm fairly appreciative to begin with, but it really helped me to focus on that for between that session and the next one. We had chance to do creative uh, some art expression of what we were talking about and I absolutely love that very uh, that to me I don't get much time in my busy life to do creative things and that was fantastic um, I and I also really valued the uh, the management and organizational change models you know reading the books that we did looking at how those can work I, I've really taken that in and used some of that uh, in a helpful way. So part of it was really this learning, and then part of it was this deep reflection, and then how to incorporate and integrate those two. So I, I can't say enough. I, I recommend it to anyone who uh, is inclined and uh, come discover what what there is to to learn. Thank you.